Williams 31, July 13th. All the pre-fight material had Williams. You're good about here? You're good here. Y'all have any questions? Touch him up. Oh. There's the bell. Mistake. Dennis Alford to keep the punches up. These are vicious punches. Oh, fights for a variety of reasons. Cited for low blows in a couple of fights back in England. Tyson digging the... Another left hook upstairs. A left uppercut staggers Williams. It's in trouble in the early going. The hard way. Now, Danny Williams has still standing. Look at him. He's on the inside and tremendously something happened to Tyson. He may have gotten a low blow, but he is digging in. Left uppercut to the chin. After... Danny Williams laying on the inside with Mike Tyson. Now he will, I think, throw an uppercut here. Yes, and when he told us that was going to happen. That was their way of dealing with it. And then it was the Tyson uppercut that would add to the problems of Danny Williams. So later on, again, Tyson ripping shots to the body. Throwing those tremendous left hooks with Frank and for Mike Tyson. Bodes well for the future. He counted Danny Williams told us he wants to take this fight to the fourth or fifth or sixth round. But the problem is that when he throws it, he's able to get Tyson ripping uppercuts to the chin. Now back comes Williams with a left-right combination. And that was the uppercut by Williams. He's ripping those shots. Pushing Tyson back. It's competitive now. And we have theorized and been told that there's a possibility that he twisted his knee. And you see him tuck. Tyson Williams with a left uppercut to the body. Williams fighting off. He is really right. making an impact. Well, he took a point away for something. And here comes Tyson. So confusion uh, reigns here in round three. Jeffrey might be a factor in this fight, and guess what? He is. We had first thought, but weren't sure. Oh, a left hook to the neck by Mar Williams coming back. A warning for using the forearm by Mike Tyson on the inside. Getting nailed with some big right eye of, of Mar One for an elbow and one for a low blow. So he lost two points. But it was on in the chest. And back comes Williams. Constitutes the late fourth round is the later round. That's he doesn't look. He's trying to one punch right now. Williams knows it and he throws combinations. Vander Holyfield and Lennox Lewis and he's having his way. Firing shots. Tyson in some difficulty here in round four. comes in and knocks out Mike Tyson. And we'll see how he did it. Tyson was in some trouble and tired at this point. And how about the combination punching with Williams? And again, using, mixing in the body shots, the uppercut, which is a superb punch for him. Mike Tyson had no answer. And once Williams put him down, there was very little sign that Tyson was going to get up. He did finally struggle up after what appeared to be a pretty long count. And still, though Tyson made an effort to get up, he didn't beat the count. He's the winner by way of a stunning knockout, Danny Williams.